Hello guys, welcome back to Chris Poly channel. This video I want to share about how to craft Marni sniper rifle, new hunting sniper rifle from Land of Morning Light. Okay, to enjoy watch my video, make sure you turn on this video subtitle, and also you can use timestamp that I already provide to go to target topic that you want. And if you haven't subscribed yet, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on bell notification to get any update and guide on Black Desert World. Okay, let's start this video content using any feature that I provide. Okay, about this Marni sniper rifle, actually this is new sniper rifle that just update with Land of Morning Light region and benefit by using this Marni sniper rifle, you will unlock new feature when hunting any monster to get more rewards. And in this video, I want to focus about how to craft this Marni sniper rifle. And if you watch this video before this Land of Morning Light update to our live server, at least you can prepare anything before this update come. Okay, to craft this Marni sniper rifle, you only can craft it from Land of Morning Light region, especially on Dokebi Forest. On this note, there are special workshop that located on this area. And if you click this workshop, you can rent this Dokebi workshop to craft this Marni sniper rifle. And material to craft this Marni sniper rifle, you need one piece plus 10 hunting sniper rifle that have blue grade, scorching sun gemstone, 10 pieces, mystic powder, 1000 pieces. Actually, this is special new item that you only can get it from Land of Morning Light content, fire horn, 1000 pieces. And the last is resplendent obsidian, 10 pieces. And how to collect all this material? And about mystic powder, actually this is special item that you only can get it from Land of Morning Light excavation node. For its excavation node on Land of Morning Light, if you send your worker, you can get this mystic powder. Actually this is tentative name, and maybe this name will change when official translation come with this new region update. But just for your information, this item, you only can get it from Land of Morning Light Excavation Note. And there are 5 Excavation Note that you can send your worker to get this special item. Either not on the KB Forest, there are 2 Excavation Note. And next is Excavation Note on this location. There are 1 Excavation Note. And another one located at this island, at South on Land of Morning Light region. There are 1 Excavation Note. And the last at north of this location, there are another one excavation node on this location. And more detail about this node on Land of Morning Light, you can check my previous video about node guide on this new region. And to get this item is not rare, so you can collect this item 1000 pieces very easy, just stay login to make sure your worker keep working on every excavation node. And next, how to craft this hunting sniper rifle? Actually, you can craft this hunting sniper rifle by processing manufacturing 3 pieces pure iron crystal, 20 pieces steel, 1 piece lock, and 1 piece fine hard hide to craft this blue grade hunting sniper rifle. And then after you get this hunting sniper rifle, you can enhance this hunting sniper rifle until plus 10 by using blackstone weapon. And gladly, you can do force enhancing to get plus 10 hunting sniper rifle. And the next material is 10 pieces scorching sun gemstone that you can get this scorching sun gemstone from various crafting process, either using flowers magical black gemstone and scorching sun shard, or by crafting it using sharp and hard black crystal shard with one piece mask of pure magic and scorching sun shard. And next material is fire horn. Actually, this item is special item that you only can get it from hunting content when you butchering or tending any hunting monster. And you also can get this fire horn from central market if have stock. And next material is resplendent obsidian. Actually, you can craft this resplendent obsidian by processing it from obsidian ore that you also can get this obsidian ore from rock obsidian ore. And this raw material for this rock obsidian ore, you only can get it from mining node at Serkran Iron Mine that this node located at Mountain of Eternal Winter. And after you collect all this material to craft this item, you need to put all your material on one of city storage in Land of Morning Light. And after you put all this material on one of the city storage, next you need to rent this workshop at Dokebi Forest that will cost you only one contribution point. And after you finish to rent this workshop to craft this Marni sniper rifle, you just need to go to manage crafting. And if you already put all this material on one of your city storage, you can choose any idle worker that originally come from your city storage that you already put all this material. 
and you can choose one of them to craft this Marni sniper rifle. And as you can see when I using this skilled Dokebi worker, this crafting duration will take around 1 hour. Okay, let's craft this item and you just need to wait to finish to craft it. And after your worker finish to craft this Marni sniper rifle, this item will be ready on your city storage. And you can take this item and use it for hunting a new hunting monster. But take notice you only can wear this Marni hunting sniper rifle if your character have hunting level artisan 10 or higher. And next I will show you how to enhance this Marni hunting sniper rifle. To enhance this item, you need this enhancing material, Scorching Sun Gum, that you can enhance it using normal method. And gladly you also can use Force Enhance method until plus 10. And when I try to enhance this Marni hunting sniper rifle, actually from plus 1 until plus 8, this is very easy. As you can see from plus 0 until plus 1, I just use 5 false stack. And then to go to plus 2, I just use around 10 false stack. And to go to plus 3, I just use around 20 false stack. And to go to plus 4, I just use around 27 false stack. And to go to plus 5, I just use 40 false stack. And to go to plus 6, I just use 50 false stack. And to go to plus 7, I just use around 60 false stack. And to go to plus 8, I just use 80 false stack and try it multiple times. And starting to go to plus 9, this is already a bit difficult if you enhance it using normal method. But I recommend using 100 false stack to enhance it to plus 9 and plus 10 and try it multiple times. Because if you do force enhancing method, this is will need 90 pieces scorching sun gem stone and will cost 50 durability of your Marni sniper rifle. And I think this is will cost you so much silver for sacrificing 90 scorching sun gem stone. So to go to plus 9 and plus 10, I recommend you to use 100 false stack and try it multiple times because this enhancing rate or the very low. And don't worry, if you fail to enhance this Marni sniper rifle, this enhancement level will not drop, and its fail will cost your Marni sniper rifle durability 5 points that you can repair it using memory fragment. And this is my sample calculation, how much cost to craft this Marni sniper rifle. And when I record this video, this is price from Central Market on SEA server at 13 May 2023, and this is will cost around 300 million silver to craft this Marni hunting sniper rifle. And when this land of morning light come to our live server, you also can sell this Marni sniper rifle to Central Market, and you also can purchase it from Central Market directly if someone sell it. And after 10 May 2023 maintenance update, Prebis just update about mechanic to get resource from sniper hunting mechanic that they already implement accumulate damage mechanic rather than hunting mastery. And about this accumulate damage mechanic, this is new mechanic to get any item from sniper hunting content that this hunting loot resource will depend on accumulate damage on specific target area of animal that you hunt. And more detail mechanic of this content. I think I will review it later when this land of morning light update to our live server in future. So stay tuned on Chris Poly channel. And special thanks to all my membership for direct support via Patreon, Karya Karsa, and YouTube membership. And also my current member, Dubia Dut, Jimmy Snake, Doki, Angel, Ayrton, Wemi, Bebu, Iliana Nico, Detraki, Grosak, Snot, Sorshop TV, Cho Tomate, Lana Love Linda, Seni Pegar, S Gold Member, and also for all my silver and bronze member, thank you so much for all your direct support. This is will make Chris Poly channel running and growing more faster. If you want to support me directly, I will very grateful. And as special thanks, I will put your name on my video depend on your support level. And be noticed at some level there are have some limit, so make sure you didn't get run out for this limited space. And I will put your name on every subsequent video that I release for the duration of your support. And if you want to join my membership to support me directly, you can go to any platform for Patreon, Karya Karsa, and YouTube membership. I already put link for this membership on this video description. Or you can check on top right of this video, I already put card for Patreon link. Okay guys, that's all how to craft Marni Sniper Rifle from Land of Morning Light. 
Hope this video can be useful for you. If you like this video, you can like and subscribe to my channel for another guide and update. Thank you for watching. See you next time.